Huh. Why does he always look like that? Sometimes I think he's a maniac. Where did this is a nice guy? He's just a little eccentric. <laughs> what are you doing? This is Jack Hammer's box. He's the captain of a football team. If he finds out, we're gonna be in huge trouble. Well, he won't. Um, 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 um. They have a game at another school stadium today. Ah. Uh. <laughs> the bell rang, and Roger, Bugsy, and Harley hurried to the history class. During the class, their teacher talked about the life and culture of the Mayan Indians. Bugsy listened to her stories with enthusiasm. Roger was more interested in listening to music than hearing a story about some tribes, while Harley fell asleep. Harley, wake up! Uh, uh, hmm. Roger, take off your headphones. <laughs> ah! Literature class was next on the schedule, and it was Bugsy's least favorite subject. <laughs> Bugsy, put your smartphone away now! Hmm. As soon as the school was finished, the guys joyfully rushed home. <laughs> Yay, finally! Freeze, you are grounded! But why? Your teachers complained. Harley, you slept in class. Roger, listen to music. And Bugsy, you were playing on the phone. But... No buts. To the after-school class, all of you. During that after-school class, the boys just continued doing the same stuff. Harley was sleeping, Roger was listening to music, and Bugsy was playing on his smartphone. Hmm. Guys, half an hour more and we're off! What? It's night time! Come on, wake up! Oh. Finally, I got some sleep! Ah. Ah. What time is it now? It's half past 11! Why didn't anyone wake us up? <sighs> Look! Some weird book appeared on the table! Tale of Mascot Psychopath? Bugs, read aloud! Bugsy started reading. 
The book told the tale of the school's mascot, Hair Mo. The kids just adored him. Hair Mo loved children too, but only the ones who were well behaved. He was not fond of hooligans. <laughs> <laughs> the bell rang, and most of the obedient school children headed home. While hooligans were punished, they were sent to the after school classes. The punished students fell asleep right at their desks, and while they were sleeping, Herr Mo locked all the school's exits with a chain. It was already late at night when the hooligans woke up. They tried to leave the building, but the distraught Herr Mo began to hunt them. And no one has ever heard about the hooligans again. What a stupid tale! Yeah, so stupid! Just another kids should be obedient kind of thing. Uh. Don't you think that there's way too many coincidences? Hahaha, <laughs> Bugs, are you serious? Uh. Never mind, I should call my dad. My smartphone is gone. Uh. Uh. Mine too. Uh. And I don't have mine. Ah! That really starts to bother me. Ah. I think we should call the guard. Mm -hmm. ah, uh The doors look! One more coincidence? Three keys are hidden in the drawers. Find them if you want to survive. Whom I catch, I am not to blame. Someone pinch me! Am I dreaming? Ah. Ah. Keep calm, Bugsy. We just need to find three keys. Not a big deal. Ah. And here's one! Nothing here! Just keep searching! I found another one! Good job, Harley! Just one more to go! There's this hair! <laughs> Bugsy, stop kidding around! We found all the keys! Time to go home! Uh. Huh. <laughs> uh.
<laughs> this here again! Bugsy, stop that! I'm being serious! Ah! Ooh! Ah! Ah! Hurry up! Open the blue log! <laughs> Look guys, it's the police! <laughs> what the hell? Mr. Policeman, we have a maniac here in our school! What are you talking about? It's the truth! We're telling the truth! Very well, let's check the school! Hop in the car! <laughs> On their way to school, the guys told the cop in great detail about that terrible accident that happened to them. And he also stole our smartphones! Well, here we are, kids. I'll go first and you follow me. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. Get ready. One, two, three. Ha! Don't move! Mm. Freaky Daisy? What do you think you're doing? I'll complain to the principal! Where is the hair? What do you mean? This one! Uh? You mean the mascot? Haven't seen him lately! Uh. Then where have you been? And why didn't you wake us up? I... Mm. I went about my business. Ah. You're wasting my time. No, no, no. We'll show you everything. No, 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 the kids started showing the cop all these places with lasers and also the boxes for which it was necessary to find the three keys. And in this classroom, someone stole our phones. Uh -huh. And this mysterious book lay there on the table. Look, our phones are back. Huh? 
There is a note. See you soon. Mo. Enough of this nonsense. Go home, everyone. But I'll drop you off. Just follow me. I apologize for the disturbance. Good night. Good night. <laughs> the very next morning, the kids returned to school. Only this time, Roger, Harley and Bugsy studied ever so diligently. Obviously, no one wanted to be punished again. During lunchtime, the guys started discussing their most possible identity. I really think it was Freaky Dizzy. Hmm. It could be anyone else but him. <laughs> Look, it's Jack Hammer, the captain of the football team. They dug through your locker. <laughs> hey, freaks, is that true? <laughs> Thanks for the apple! I don't feel like being punished. I need to get out. You coward! There's a fight in the canteen! Oh! That now. What's going on here? The kids had a fight. Jack, Roger, Harley, you are grounded. To the extension class, all of you. No, please, not this. Sir, please don't do this to us. Mm. Ah. <laughs> What's so funny, Dizzy? <laughs> Will everything repeat again? You do what you want, and I will prepare myself.
The kids decided to go to the gym for a workout before their possible encounter with the hair mole. I'll grab this too! We might need it! While Harley was in the gym, Roger was telling Jack Hammer everything about this mad hair mo. As if I'd believe you, idiot! Roger, just look what I've got! <gasps> what the hell is that? Uh? What the? Uh. <laughs> A sleeping gas! That's why we fell asleep right away! I mean, you love sleeping generally. There's no time for jokes. We need to get out now. We can use the crowbar to break the window. Mm. Mm -hmm. <gasps> <gasps> oh no! I overslept my workout. Ah. Hey, freaks! Why didn't anyone wake me up? Uh... Jack, everything I told you, it's true! Uh... Look, the hair! Uh... Ha! 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 You got a dead wish hair? Harley, help me! He caught me! Run! Where is he? We can use this wing to fly over that fence! <laughs> the next morning, Roger and Harley didn't go to school. Instead, they went straight to the police station. The request is accepted. Hmm? What's there? 
The captain of the high school football team is missing. We know what happened to him. You again. Please listen, it's getting quite serious. Huh? Uh huh? All right, let's talk in my office. Go on now, tell me. The kids told the officer that the accident with Herr Moe happened yet again. The beast easily killed the big guy, Jack Hummer, but Roger and Harley were lucky enough to escape. Also, he uses sleeping gas. Alright then, listen to my plan. Where are your friends, Roger and Harley? I don't know. Truants, I am going to report them to the principal. But what if Herr Mo caught them? Then I left my friends in trouble. How do you do, fellow kids? Oh. Hey, freaks! Give me all your money! Get lost! You got a death wish? We have to get back to the class. Great. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> Guys, you're alive! Uh, Coward! <laughs> ah! Ah! During the chemistry class, Black had started messing around with various reagents. Ah! <laughs> Roger and Harley had a lot of fun, but the teacher completely freaked out. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Principal! I want to file a complaint on a new student. First he flew into the room on a skateboard, and now he's made a terrible mess! A new student? Okay, I'm on my way! The bell rang. It was the last lesson, so all the children rushed home. Hmm. You stop! Hmm. Roger and Harley, you are punished for skipping classes. And you, Black Hat, repeater? Yeah, 
You are punished for skateboarding and pampering during the chemistry lesson. He also started a fight. And for that too. Ah. <laughs> All three of you must go to the detention class now. <laughs> Great! Everything goes according to the plan. Let's move to the second part. Black Hat prudently took three gas masks with him, so that Hair Mo's sleeping gas wouldn't affect the guys this time. Out. It's too early to rejoice. Mm. Now let's wait for your hair. <gasps> How long shall we wait? Quiet! Someone's coming! <gasps> oh! ah! Freaky Dizzy? <gasps> <gasps> so you are here, Mo! I just came to check if everything is all right with you. Huh? Too many coincidences. Blacka, turn around. Huh? Ah! Ah! Well, here, there you are. Principal? Ah. Ah. I got you. I just wanted to scare you. So you start being diligent students. You'll tell me about it in court. Ah. Something's wrong here. That hair was much taller and more dangerous. Look, here's the hair. The case is closed. Ah! Yeah, you're right. Ah! This is Black Hat. I caught a dangerous school maniac. I'm calling for reinforcements. See you tomorrow, Dizzy. <laughs> Why are you laughing so weirdly? That's a disease. All right. Well, bye. Bye, guys. Ah. 
Uh, who are you? After successfully apprehending Herr Mo, the police gave Roger and Harley a ride home. Something is wrong here. What do you mean? That hair mo look different. Ah, forget it. It's bedtime. Good night. Yeah, good night. Black Hat's shift was not over yet. He now had to interrogate Montgomery's school principal, mm. Mr. Rabbits, on a lie detector. Mm. Officer Black Hat, everything is ready. You can start the interrogation. Uh huh. Uh. Tell me, where is Jack Hummer's body? I don't know. Huh? How many times did you dress up as hair? Two, today and yesterday. Where were you last night? Oh, at home. <laughs> he tells the truth. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Something is wrong. That hair was a lot bigger and more frightening. Hmm. Ah. Uh. We'll continue tomorrow. I'm tired. It's time to go home. Ah. Uh. Hmm. Drop me off at my house. It was another school morning. Roger and Harley drove to classes. How did you sleep? Well, I didn't. Do you still think that we got the wrong guy? I think we need to talk to Dizzy. It's the first time I don't see Dizzy in his place. Yeah, that's weird. Let's go and ask Kimisto. Hi there! Have you seen Dizzy? No, I haven't. I also couldn't find the principal. Alright then. <coughs> the school day passed in an instant. The kids attentively listened to their teachers and participated just like the most obedient students. Then it was time for lunch. Roger and Harley had an intense conversation about two different hair moles. Harley, we need to stay in school. Why? To catch the real hair mo. Roger, you're being paranoid. But we have to learn the truth. I've had enough. I'm going home. Roger, I'm so sorry I acted like a coward and left you there. Yeah, man. I'd like to help you to catch the real hair mo. Really? Boxy began to tell that already then, during the first time, he noticed that the hairs were completely different. But he thought that he was simply deceived by fear, besides the fact that he had poor eyesight. Well, after you said it, everything connects. 
There are indeed two hairs. We have to solve this mystery. <laughs> Application accepted. What is this? The school's guard went missing. Dizzy? Oh no! In order to remain undetected at school, Roger and Bugsy decided to hide inside the lockers. Roger, and now what? What are you doing here? We... I forgot my headphones in the canteen! <laughs> Whoa, we almost got caught. So, how do we find him? I think he'll find us first. It will take quite a... <gasps> hey kid, where's your friend? Uh, he's paranoid. He's in the school catching the real hair Mo. Get in the car right now! We can waste a minute! <gasps> Did something happen to Roger? We'll find out soon, but my god says he was right all along! Bugsy, follow me! Ah! To the chemistry class! Chemisto has to be there! Ah! No one's here! Looks like the hair took him too! If you run after two hairs, you will catch neither. Black Hat Harley! Is he some kind of mutant? Mutant? Anti mutagen! Hey, hair! <laughs> the chemist? Talk! What does this all mean? The chemist began to talk. He told everything. How during one of the teacher's parties, the principal proposed an idea of how they could educate naughty students. According to the idea, the principal would dress up in the costume of the old mascot of the school, Hair Mo, playing different scenes from horror movies in front of the punished children. And no kid would want to be punished like that again. And why are you involved? Well, I decided to use it all for my own purposes. It turned out that the chemist was secretly working on a drug that could create mutants. He had already tried it on himself, 
but he needed more test subject Robloxers to improve the results. He decided to use the director's idea to kidnap the punished children, and in order to confuse everyone, he turned into the mutant hair mo himself. Just as I expected, the principal was arrested, and no one thought it could be me. Well, thanks for your full confession. You're under arrest. Aww. And what about Jack Hammer and Freaky Dizzy? Ah, <laughs> <laughs>